Okay, this is a 2003 Hummer H2 that we have for sale. Um, here's the damage that it has for the salvage title. It must have got run into something in the front. Um, nothing really big, but I guess that brush guard must have hit something. So that's going to need to be reworked and then have the hood repainted. You can use it the way it is. It doesn't really affect anything. Um, but it is what it is. It now has, it had originally a Texas salvage title. Now it has a Nebraska previously salvage title, which makes it licensable and everything. Um, as you can see, door pad is missing. Do not have that. That uh, piece here needs to be repainted. Um, cracking that dash over on the right side in the plastic piece, that's an insert. Uh, headliner's decent. Driver's side is fairly decent. Passenger side does have um, that damage over there on the right. Um, fire it up real quick. Hope my does have the check engine light, which I think is something to do with the gas cap, possibly, or the vacuum system back to the tank. that run. Hopefully I have enough tape to get this done. I've been having problems getting this tape done so hopefully it's going to work this time. Uh, it does not have a spare tire. You can get one of if you live in a bigger city. Fairly reasonable. Probably for about 50 bucks you get a wheel. Um, and then you can get a tire mounted up. And driver's side, or passenger side rear armrest comes off. Um, that needs to be resecured. As you can see, it comes off and needs to be reconsidered. Some of those clips are broken. You could get that to work. Um, silicone, double face tape, Velcro, somebody said. Um, but it runs well, drives well. Mechanically, it seems to be okay. Um, let's get this hood open. Actually, this thing might be able to enough to. Windshield is good. Hopefully, this thing doesn't quit. Looks like it has a 2014 battery in it. Get the six. .0 V6 sounds quiet, runs good. Um, we'll go around where that damage is at, see if we can see anything more. There's a little bit right here that needs to be just pulled out, just a little bit, not very much. Um, the uh, Once you get everything apart, I think you'll be in fairly decent shape to get that fixed and get it back to normal. Um, I don't think it's going to be a, a real major thing. If you don't know how to do it, I guess anything's major, but... It is what it is. That's what it is. That's the reason the price is low as it is. These things should be, you know, twelve to 14000 real easy. Um, but you can drive it the way it is too, so. It's just a little bit of fix that corner. The hood, when you when it does come down, it does want to hang up over in that corner a little bit. You need two people to, one person to let it down, another person looking closely, then you can figure out exactly what needs to happen there. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. About running out of time on this video, guys, so. Got any questions? Uh, if you, Feel free to email me or give me a call if you got my number. If not, we can talk on the phone. That would be fine too. All right, thank you.